Hey guys, John with Off-Grid Homesteading. Hopefully there's uh, not too much wind noise here. I don't have a little wind thing on it right now. But uh, just an update, today is August the 13th, it's Monday. Um, last few days we've been dealing with Kelly's mom in the hospital and uh, a couple of uh, small uh, heart attacks and stuff like that that uh, they're dealing with. So there we've been having to take time uh, to go down there and handle all of that. But um, just want to give you an update of what's going on here now too. Um, got most, probably 98% of the taping and stuff done on the building. Uh, the only section that we're not able to complete is the one that's right here in between the trailer and the building. Uh, there's a small section that comes all the way from, from the top to the bottom that I just can't get to. So uh, until the trailer's moved, I can't finish that off. But outside of that, everything looks pretty good. Um, so pretty much all the wiring and everything is completed. Let me just take you a quick walk around. All the taping is done. I do have to pull out all of the rest of the windows except for the ones that we've already uh, taped already. And uh, we have to pull them out, level them. Um, well, before we pull them out and level them, we got to do the um, this uh, zip tape and stuff around the base of the sill and up about six to eight inches just to waterproof the sills. So, got this side done here. And got all of this done here. Once we uh, have done all the sills and stuff, I'll come back and finish off uh, under the eaves uh, and stuff over here. I did most of it, but I was using a lot of the tape and I want to make sure I got the main areas that were some more susceptible to the water done first. Um, I got about a third uh, third of this done. So we're probably going to take about one, one whole roll to finish this up. And those are like 25 bucks a roll. So main stuff first. Whatever's left on the rolls afterwards, we'll come back and uh, finish all this. So power box and everything, uh, like I said, this whole area down here is going to have this mudroom, which is going to be all the way to here. This is going to be where the wall comes out. All these wires and everything are going to be coming out uh, right at the, at the wall edge or into the wall for this room. And uh, on all this side here too. And this side here. So, so we got our brought our stove over, so we know exactly where to step out the walls. So we're going to try to do today is, uh, well, I'm going to get the the wall up that goes between that bedroom and the living room up over here, and then um, this is where the step outs and stuff. This is going to be underneath the uh, underneath the floor. And then we're going to have our stub outs for water and gas and other stuff uh, going through here. Hey, there's Kelly O. All right, so let me go ahead and pause this and put it on uh, slow mo so you can watch the build process. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.